where does the vitamin C go? And other nutrients that degrade in food storage or through the cooking process. They undergo a chemical reaction and transform into something else that does not have the same biological activity. Now let's take vitamin C as an example. Vitamin C is a molecule made up of six carbons, six oxygens, and eight hydrogens. Here's its molecular structure. Now vitamin C can actually degrade in multiple different ways, and you can end up with different series of chemical reactions that result in different molecular products. So for example, vitamin C can oxidize forming dehydroascorbic acid, which can then undergo hydrolysis, the breaking of molecular bonds by water, to form a variety of different molecules like L-tartrate and oxalate. Yo, all those people avoiding eating spinach but taking high dose vitamin C. And then there's also photodegradation pathways. So the degradation that's stimulated by uh, exposure to light, typically, higher energy light, so like UV wavelengths. There's thermal degradation, which happens at different rates at different temperatures, but that is that 10% loss of vitamin C when we steam broccoli. So the type of degradation and the products of vitamin C degradation are influenced by the environment. Presence of oxygen, exposure to light, the temperature, the pH, so the acidity, the presence or absence of other things for vitamin C to react with. It's complex biochemistry that I will not pretend to fully understand. But I also know that the details of all of these chemical reactions uh, was not the question. The question was simply, where does it go? Fundamental law of chemistry, matter is neither formed nor destroyed, it is simply transformed. The carbons, oxygens, and hydrogens that make up the vitamin C molecule get rearranged to make different molecules. 